And now here's Tommy Gomes talking about sea bass, but pay attention, this one's gonna be a quick one. Look at this, beautiful California white sea bass, sustainably harvested, local fish coming out of California, Northern Baja. The great thing about this fish is that it's being raised in pens by Scripps and SeaWorld, and they release 10,000, 20,000 fingerlings a year. And we're gonna cook it up, we're gonna cut it up, and I'm gonna show you a really cool prize that's inside the cranium here. Very sweet, mild flavor, fat content's great. We're gonna cook some of this up on the Sporting Chef TV show coming up next. In the last segment, we talked about the white sea bass and what was really cool about it. And in this segment, what I'm gonna do is I took the head and I split it open. And the surprise about this, let me dig these out. These are calcium deposits, which is on each side of the cranium. And it allows the fish to stabilize in the kelp and not swim or roll from one side to the next. You can actually make a matching set of earrings with these. They're really cool. They look better on Scott than they do on me. We're gonna send him a pair just in case he wants them. So again, up into the cranium of the white sea bass are the calcium deposits. Allows it to stabilize its equilibrium in the kelp and that's why we call them the ghost because when you're diving for them and you're gonna use a spear gun on them, they're there, you don't see them, and then poof, they take off. You didn't see them because they're stabilized in the kelp forest. Pretty neat, California white sea bass. Next segment, I'm gonna burn some of it up. At least I'm gonna try and cook it. We'll see you later. So we got the California white sea bass, skin on filet, scaled. We're gonna crisp it up. I'm gonna cut this up in manageable pieces and uh, we're just gonna have a little bit of fun with it. Do a little salt. I'm gonna lay it flesh side down first. Turn up the heat a little bit. One of the things that I like to do with the Camp Chef's griddle top, when I'm cooking a couple of pieces of fish, I like to use a little trick. I'm just gonna cover it up, cook it off. Let that steam get in there and keep it nice and moist. When I cook it up medium rare, the fish will finish off in the plate for you. I'm just gonna roll it over. High Mountain Bayou Bass. It's got a great flavor to it. And what we're gonna do is we're just gonna sprinkle the top. I'm gonna take a little bit of butter, drop it in between the fillets, cover it up. We're gonna grab our tongs, remove this aluminum here. Look at that. Look at that crispy fish skin. That's beautiful right there. That's how you want it. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a little baby kale salad. Gonna lay that on the plate. It's an awful lot for one person, but hey, we're eating fresh fish. Gonna do a little bit of blackberry balsamic vinegar. Just drizzle that on the plate. Squeeze a lemon. The California white sea bass, sustainably harvested. It's good for you. Remember, you are what you eat. And that's all I got.